Put away the, the, the cool persona and all this kind of stuff we're trying to construct into ourselves. And the best thing you can say to a girl is hi. It's the best thing you can say, and you know, hi, I was over there, and now I'm over here because I want to say hi to you. That's it. And just, and make statements. Don't ask, I don't think you guys should ever ask girls questions. Uh, it should be just statements. In other words, just say, you know what, I'm sorry to disturb you two girls, but I was there with my friend Brian, and I, and I wanted to come up and say, you look, you look nice, and you look fantastic, and, and thank you for that. I just wanted to make a statement. Or it was nice talking to you. I would like to have coffee with you sometime, a statement. That's fundamentally different than a lot of people say. Yeah. Say, ask a question to be engaging. No. But you're saying, and I remember this from your book, you yeah. would say a lot of stuff like, you intrigue me. Uh, yeah. Statements like that. There's something intriguing yeah, who, about you. Who is this girl in front of me? I didn't get a sense that I want to know because I'm curious and, I'm, and, and I believe in life and I'm a student of life. I'm a student of women. I'm a student of my own self. I want to understand you and, and, and my attraction to you. And why, why, do you think, why do you think statements are more powerful than questions? You know, you think of it like this. Because, you know, if a guy's going to a girl and he's saying, listen, you know, it was nice talking to you. Would, would you like to get coffee sometime? Or are you busy on Thursday evening? Or... Um, um, you're doing anything this weekend? Now, he's doing more than what most guys are doing. At least he's showing up, and he's like, yeah. he's, but he's, he's asking her out at least. But if you just change those phrases, instead of saying, would you like to have coffee sometime? You say, you know what, you and I should have coffee. Or I would like to have coffee with you. Statement, ends of the period. Uh, instead of like, uh, are, are, you, are, you, are you busy on Thursday evening? You say, you know what, Thursday evening, we should get together. You make a statement, it sounds the same. An observer would not know. But internally, and in the girl's mind, it shifts it into, here's a guy who's just speaking his truth to the world. He's not asking for anything. He's just saying what he would like, how he would like his world arranged. I would like to have coffee with you. That's what I know. He's, so I see, are you speaking his truth, putting it out there? Yeah, he's putting and it out there, letting it land. You said polarity earlier. And yeah. in that, I, I'm feeling polarity. The way you did it to me, yeah. the first way, there wasn't as much polarity. When you made the statement, yeah. there was this tension. Polarity. Yeah, but the question, it's kind of like, um, if you say yes, you're free on Thursday night. Now I can construct my life around that. But instead, he's saying, in my worldview, it would be—I don't even know your name and your friend. I'm sorry, but I would love to see you on Thursday night. That's my statement of truth. That's that is what I believe to be true. You—you you can't reject my statement of truth. No. I'm not asking you for you know if I'm just saying this is what I would like to have happen. If she can respond in any way, but you've done your job as a man. You showed up. I also see when you do it, you do it with a very light, playful heart. Yes, always, always, always. Guys are t guys are too serious and too trying to be intense, and 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 women want to have fun and be caught up in something greater than themselves too. They they're bored of their accountant job and their routines like that, and they want to have. And I don't mean a clown is jumping around and you know squeaky squeaky, you know. But he's like, but to have the brightness of exhilaration of like, wow, can you see the sky and, and that music? And, and I'm here talking to you. Is there anything better on earth? No. So I'm making a statement about that. You look great in this environment. I, and, and, and there's no neediness in it. There might be great desire. Desire is a great thing. You're attractive to me and I would love to know why. What is the qualities about you that make me go, wow, look at this girl. But there's no neediness in that at all. Start going down the bar saying hi to every single person, not skipping a soul. Boom, boom, have a conversation with every person in that bar. What would it be like to be the master at the art of creating sexual tension with women? To be so good that you don't even think about it. You just do it because that's who you are.